Uh, we have Andreas Michael, uh, All Stars Training Center head coach for MMA Rocks. Hello, sir. How are you doing? Fine, thank you. How are you? Uh, I'm fine. I'm always enjoying Stockholm, uh, lovely place. Once again, uh, UFC is coming to Sweden, and uh, I know that means for you that you are a very, very busy man. Uh, how much do you enjoy UFC coming here, and how how tired are you with so many fighters fighting here? Well, it's always uh, a, a pleasure to have uh, all my fighters uh, fighting on the, the at home uh, in front of our uh, family and friends. It's an honor, and uh, I think that it's a lot of work, though. Yeah, it's a lot of work, a lot of pressure we have to win. But uh, everyone here like, fighting the UFC, the great athletes, and is going to give a great show. Yeah. Uh, we have uh, two fights between Swedes and Poles. Uh, let's start with Tor Trank fighting uh, Krzysztof Jotko. How familiar are you with, with Jotko, and uh, what do you think about that fight? Uh, Thor is going to fight Jotko. Uh, I think... Uh, uh, Jotko, we, we fought in. The, I, I, he was our opponent in the last fight uh, with Magnus. Uh, so I, I'm, pre I'm pretty familiar about his style. He's a very good fighter, uh, strong, and it's going to be a good fight. Uh, we have our game plan, and uh, it's, it's going to be a tough fight for us. Absolutely, Polish uh, fighters are tough. Are tough. We know because you come and spar with us, so we, that you give us hell. So. You're, you're tough, uh, very good and tough fighters. Yeah. The one who you, you know uh, is is also Jan Bojovic. Uh, he used to come to yes. to Sweden and he's fighting your fighter, yes. Iri Latifi. What is your opinion about that uh, that fight? Uh, another great fighter in uh, Jan. Uh, Jan is a friend of mine as well. Uh, it's going to be a very good fight. I don't have anything negative to say about anything. Like I know that uh, both of these, Jotko and Jan, are very good fighters. Uh, and my guys are very good fighters and they're going to give a, a great show. It's going to be a great show against two great athletes, four great athletes. You know, well, the whole the whole card is has is full of uh, great athletes. You know, so it's going to be a great day uh, uh, fighting at our, in our home uh, town in front of our friends and family. Uh, you've got a quite close relation with with Anko Zapasy Poznań. Uh, they they coming uh, in a big groups training with you, and Jan is representing Anko right now. Does it change anything in in your relation with Polish team? Absolutely not. Uh, it's it's a sport, and we fight against each other, and then we're friends again. They're going to take a beer, you know. So uh, I think that uh, they tell us to fight. We have to fight, and uh, we we step in as sportsmen. But uh, we're still friends. Uh, the coach is a is a good friend of mine. They they can they will always welcome to come to All Stars. They've invited us to come to Poland many times as well. Uh, we help each other develop all the time, and I think that uh, it's just a good working relationship. And sometimes we're going to have to fight against each other because we have the best fighters. So it's it's something that. Uh, we try to avoid, but if it happens, then we we do it in the best possible way. Okay, uh, a lot of fighters coming to Ostar, but uh, I want to ask first about uh, Andrzej Kościelski, who was also uh, running some uh, training sessions in in All Stars. It's not a, uh, it, it's kind of a odd uh, to to um, bring other coach to, to let other coach uh, run sessions. What do you think about about uh, the sessions that your fighters had with with Polish coach? The coach for the yes, yes. Uh, he, he's a fantastic coach, and uh, I think that uh, uh, if we can learn something new, that uh, I don't know everything, uh, but uh, together we know a lot. So uh, if we can uh, mix our minds together and put them together and learn things from each other then uh, we become better fighters and better coaches and uh, we learn from each other and uh, that's very important i think that uh, uh, the polish coach is a great great coach he has a very tough fighters that uh, give us hell in sparring and uh, we've le we learn a lot every time uh, they they come down and uh, i hope they learn a lot from us as well uh, what's your opinion about Polish MMA? Because you know a lot of Polish fighters, not only from Ankos, but a lot of them uh, coming to train with you. What's your opinion about Polish fighters? I think that Polish fighters are very tough uh, fighters, very, very strong. They have a, go a good conditioning. They, they come to win. 
and uh, we're expecting good, tough fights. Uh, we've prepared for for hell, and uh, we're going to give hell as well. Uh, I think that Polish fighters are very, are very good. The level is hiring all the time with great coaches uh, uh, there, uh, great fighters, and uh, I think that uh, the Polish fighters are some of the best uh, in Europe. Uh, I want to ask you about Carlos Prada. Carlos uh, won two fights on IRFA against Polish fighters and he got a title fight on uh, professional MMA league in Poland. Uh, how is his preparation going? His preparation is going good. Uh, he's, Carlos is a very talented uh, boy. He's, he's very uh, strong. He's got a lot of skill. He's, he's, he's very smart when he, the way that he fights. And uh, he has a lot of uh, knowledge in, in all areas. So. Oh, well, he, his, his preparation is going well, he's, he's, he's finishing off right now all the hard work because next week he's going to fight. So he's finishing off all the hard work that, he, that we've already done. So uh, last sparring here and there, and, uh, but uh, everything's going good. He's going to go to Poland prepared. Okay, uh, thank you very much for your time and uh, enjoy uh, the show on Saturday. Good luck. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you.